Alright, so filming in a Moby. Uh, again, I was asked about how to do this at the beach the other day from some new parents and uh, take the opportunity to show you. So the Moby is folded in half and it's always good to fold it in half. And the middle point, so it's folded in half this way, actually, so that. This way it's folded in half. And lengthwise, that's the midpoint where the tag is. So you bring it around. By the way, feel free to check out my uh, other video on doing this with a relatively newborn, uh, born March 30th, and this is June 21st. Sorry, I haven't done the math. And we're also going to show you with our little guy, who is now just over 16 months. Now, he's just been playing ball, so I'm not sure how happy he is going to be getting into doing this right now. Are you going to come and show us? Okay. Ready? One, two, three. And in, and in, and in. Oh. Oh, does Callum have the ball? So you see I'm holding one hand up at the, on his bump. And this bent edge is the leading edge. I bring that over the shoulder. The trailing edge is this loose one here. Now I bring that, and I hold the leading edge underneath, and I pull it tight. I held his bum up to hold the weight so that he sinks down into the weight of the Moby. And then his leg will hold that in place. With Derek, I hold him up higher than I do a younger baby because younger babies, I want them to rest on my chest. And older children like Derek, I want them to leading edge, trailing edge. Older babies like Derek, I want them to be able to see over my shoulder more. Good. One, two. Excellent. I bring it behind, I try and keep the straps flat, and I have the straps flat on my back, as you can see there too, in that cross pattern. Now, if you're not able to get the ties all the way around, because you maybe just had a baby and you can't tie them around yet, my wife reminded me of that at one point, and uh, just tie it behind, that works just fine. Here and here. Here, tie it once, tie it twice, and then check your edges. So I pull the folded edge or the leading edge through and I stretch it out nice so that the trailing edge comes under the bum and the leading edge comes out to the knee. I do the same thing on the other side. In this way he's got lots of support and the last thing that I do is really noticeable as the babies get bigger. As I go in and I grab that initial piece and I pull it up the back. Here and here. The baby's held in place now that this is his seat belt and all is well. Now, you can see here that Derek has supported from the inside the cross pieces, and Derek likes to spend most of his time now with his hands out, and that's fine, he's still in support, and we can, we can jump and we can play, and everything <laughs> is fun in here, and it's all good. So, check out the other video with, uh, how old's Jack? 10 weeks. With a 10 week baby? And there's lots of opportunity for great carrying and being nice and close and having your baby in facing you and you get to control the stimulation and they're great cuddles and snugs. Okay, you ready for a hike? Let's go! Mwah.